Your vehicle is equipped with an electric park brake system, or EPB. The EPB not only offers simple operation, it also includes some features in addition to those found on conventional park brakes. As you know, the park brake is primarily intended to prevent the vehicle from rolling while parked. So, before leaving the vehicle, make sure that the transmission is in park and the EPB is applied. You can engage it using the EPB switch located in the center console. You can also have the EPB engage automatically every time you put the vehicle in park by enabling the auto park brake feature in the customer programmable features settings through the touch screen or through the instrument cluster display. Here's a quick note though, you may hear a slight whirring sound from the back of the vehicle while the EPB engages or disengages. And if your foot is on the brake pedal while you apply the EPB, you may notice a small amount of brake pedal movement. To apply the EPB manually, pull up on the switch momentarily. Once the EPB is fully engaged, the brake warning lamp in the instrument cluster and an LED indicator on the switch will illuminate if the ignition is in the on-run position. If the ignition is in the stop-off position, the brake warning lamp will not illuminate. Keep in mind the EPB can only be released when the ignition is in the on-run position. Now, if the auto park brake feature has been enabled, the EPB will automatically engage whenever the transmission is placed into park or with a manual transmission when the ignition is in the stop-off position. The EPB will release automatically when the ignition is in the on-run position, the transmission is placed in drive or reverse, the driver's seat belt is buckled, and an attempt is made to drive away. To release the EPB manually, the ignition must be in the on-run position. Put your foot on the brake pedal and push the EPB switch down momentarily. Once the EPB is fully disengaged, the brake warning lamp in the instrument cluster and the LED indicator on the switch will go out. Your vehicle's EPB also features safe hold. Safe hold will automatically engage the EPB if the vehicle is left unsecured while the ignition is in the on-run position. For example, with automatic transmissions, safe hold will automatically engage the EPB if the vehicle is at a standstill, there is no attempt to depress the brake pedal or accelerator pedal, the seat belt is unbuckled, and the driver's door is open. For manual transmissions, the EPB will automatically engage if the vehicle is at a standstill, there is no attempt to depress the brake pedal or accelerator pedal, the clutch pedal is not pressed, the seat belt is unbuckled, and the driver's door is open. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.